Welcome back to my channel friends. Hi, this is Sonia here and I am so 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 happy that I am doing this video. I actually wanted to do this video since long like I say for almost all my videos because trust me I have a long list of videos which I really want to do but uh, it takes a lot of time to make up a video, to prepare a video and then uh, somehow I feel that I am an artist who uh, needs a lot of planning before shooting a video because I really don't want to end up making anything and everything in my videos. So it takes a lot of time, trust me. Okay, uh, now today uh, I want to do this video where I am going to share what is there in my bag. Yes, it is one of the very, very, very famous video which every star, the, especially the Bollywood stars and the television stars are doing and I'm not a star but but I do watch a lot of these kind of videos and I really 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 like them and I just thought I wanted to show you with what's in my bag and this is my crafty bag so this is really big this is really really big so let's get started Okay, so I'll start with my bag first now. This is a really, really uh, big bag. This is one of my favorite bags. This is not from any brand. I'm not doing any brand promotions because I don't have any branded bags right now. And this is the only bag which I have. And I got this from uh, Thailand, from their local market on a very dirty price. And it's been eight years that I've been using this bag. And my husband calls this as a chola, which I absolutely hate it when you call it chola because this is my handbag which uh, if you have met me personally you must have seen me carrying this bag I carry this everywhere to the mall for dinners for movies for shopping for every everywhere I carry this bag and I love non-branded bags Okay, now to start with what's there in my bag. So I'm not a makeup person. Yes, I put on lipstick, but I'm not a makeup person at all. So what is there in my bag? And like you all know that I'm a crafter, so there is going to be so much of craft, crafty things on my bag and uh, in my bag. And uh, yes, I will be showing you what all are there in my bag. First of all, I am having a huge giveaway for all of you out there. And uh, whatever the stuff you will see, most of the stuff is something which I really want to give it out to all of you people out there because you all have been so kind, so generous to, uh, of course, check my videos, like them, leave love and I absolutely, absolutely love reading them and I love your feedbacks and I just really can't, uh, thank you is a very small word to uh, really... Uh, I really, really, really appreciate how much time you guys uh, put up on my video and uh, how much efforts you put and how much appreciation you give me to me. So first, we'll start with the giveaways. That yes, that is there, but I will be sharing all the guidelines at the end of this video. So do watch this video till the end. Also, you need to make sure that you watch all the stuff which I'm sharing today. Uh, these are all the steps which I have made and I will be sharing most of these items with you all. Yes, I will be sending these to you all but for that you have to follow some very 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 simple rules. So please do watch this video till end. Okay, now I've opened my bag. What's in my bag? First, 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 first. Uh, first thing, it's actually really fully as you can see. Okay, the first thing what I want to share with you all is, yes, this mixed media envelope and this is actually uh, one of the prettiest envelope which I had made and I absolutely love the way it has turned out and uh, I really love this one. So this is the one, the video tutorials are already live on my channel, you can check that. There are tons of videos which I have done and I will be showing almost, uh, not almost, but most of the videos or uh, the projects here. So this is the first one, the mixed media angular which I had done. Next one is this You Are Invited pop-up card and uh, this is one of my uh, very first cards, very first pop-up cards which I had done and uh, there's no tutorial for this one. 
But I've done very similar projects like uh, pop-up cards with the butterflies and with some other sentiments with the, for a newborn baby also. You, so you can check all of those uh, in my YouTube channel link. This is the second one. Then, then, then. This thing was actually keeping out so much from my bag. And it's the altered box the altered pringles box yes this is altered pringles box which i did very recently um this was my dt project for uh, craft treats and i absolutely love this one i know few of my friends they visited my home and i really, really wanted to take this but i did not give it to them because i wanted to share this with all of you out there so any one of the lucky person out there can get this just follow the rules and instructions at the end this is there next or oh, this is one of the cutest cutest box which i have done so it's a very cute little explosion box and this is really really nice and yes it has a niche where you can have some goodies or chocolates or uh, maybe a cupcake or something and it has four flaps so i love 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 this one its tutorial is already live on my channel do check this one this is one of a very basic, very simple, but a beautiful explosion box which I did. So, do not miss this. Now, the next project. Oh, this is one of my favorites because uh, I love altering uh, whatever the stuff is around at my home or whatever I have bought for some of the other uh, reasons. But I never use it the way it has to be used. I do some of the other things in that. So, here is ta -da! the decoupage frame. Yes, it is actually a photo frame, but I had converted it into a platter. So maybe you can have some really nice decorative stuff on this and decorate your home. You can also keep this on your center table for uh, decorating it. The video is already live. So most of the videos are already live. I think almost all the videos are live. Check all of them. All, all, all of them. Next thing. Next thing, next thing is there are so many stuff on my bag. You know, I never ever give my projects for just like that. I just store everything and everything in my craft room, and I really love, love, love having my stuff. Okay, so here are uh, four tags. These are one of my very, very precious uh, positions because. Uh, I actually created these tags from the scrap what we uh, have after our shopping. I love shopping. I do lots of shopping. I hope my husband is not watching this video because I always tell him that I don't shop anything. Okay. So these are the tags which has been made with my uh, shopping tags actually. My uh, shopping stuff and some of them has the price also. So these are the tags which I actually uh, created from the leftover pieces, the scraps and I absolutely love them. These are mixed media tags and I think it's more than a year that I created these and it is still as it is. Trust me, I'm not an organized person. My craft room is always, always, always in a mess but still they have survived mills. They have some really good strength. Okay, so I have these, uh, one set of these four tags. Or maybe I will share it in a pair of two. I don't know. It all depends on how much you guys are uh, participating. So this is there for sure. And yes. Next. Next. Oh. Next. 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 Mm -hmm. I'm just wondering what to show next. Because. Okay. I'll show this one. This is the tar explosion box. Now for this one, I was actually inspired by uh, one of the Pinterest photographs and I absolutely love that one. So then uh, that's when I decided to make this one and I made a tutorial on this and uh, I thought it is going to be very tricky, very this, very that, I don't know how to make and all. But I did it and I absolutely loved it. I absolutely loved it. So if I talk in the very, those... Uh, 
celebrate. I really can't do without these explosion box. Uh, they are a must in my bag or in my craft room or for my tutorials. But they are very very important. I'll just show you how it works. So you just keep the lid aside and just put these stuff aside. Okay. And you just have to pull this. Oops. This one. This one. This one and everything comes out really well. Now you just slide the flaps, and your tart explosion box is ready. And you can see how amazing this looks, and it also has a lid. So if you are a subscriber of my channel or if you watch my videos regularly, you must have seen this tutorial. So I have this box also to share with you all. Everyone out there. I will keep it so that you can see all the projects that I am sharing with you all. Now the next next one is really really quick one. So this is one of the mobile covers which I have altered, and this was one of my uh, mobile covers. Not a very old one. I hardly used it, but I did the dukupal work, and as good as new. I really, I really don't know the mobile name. I think it's one plus five cover. I think I'm not sure. Uh, what I'm going to do is whenever I uh, like when I'm posting the details in the description box of all the things what I have shared with you with the video tutorial link, I'll also try to put in the link for this one so that uh, you know which mobile cover I have and I ordered it. So this has a decoupage work. Now here, if you see, I have mixed media work, I have uh, decoupage work, I have uh, paper craft work. So varieties of craft work is what I do. So next thing from my kitty is um, are actually a uh, beautiful coasters which I did. Uh, they are decoupage coasters and I uh, absolutely loved it. And those are one of my initial projects which I had done. And these are the beautiful coasters and these are in car theme. And I absolutely, absolutely love this one. So yes, I'm going to give it away like these two pairs. And I really want to share everything what I have created with you all because you guys have been so amazing, so amazing to always appreciate my work. And this is just my little gesture to say uh, thank you, thank you to all of you. Now I have more things. Thank you means it's not that I have finished up everything. I have lots of stuff. So yes. Now again, I have an explosion box, and that means I do. Uh, so many explosion box in a year, and I gift most of them. But there are few which I really keep with me, so that uh, it is just uh, my way of uh, having my projects, which I really, really, really love. And this is one of them. So I had done the uh, time work with this, which I had to remove because of. Uh, some issues with uh, while storing so yes i have removed that but this is one of the beautiful explosion box what i have done again this is in black theme and uh, the central area of this box has a beautiful dry arrangement i can just show you and just see the strength of this project even though i'm just stirring like anything nothing is happening to my embellishments so that's the one of the best part and yes, it has uh, two flaps, so it's a two-layer explosion box. And even on the cover, also I did this dry arrangement work, which I absolutely loved. So yes, this is the box which I really, really, really want to give to someone out there. And uh, I hope once you get it, you will like it too. Next thing is again a decoupage project. I have so many decoupage projects and this one is which I really like. So this is one of my texture decoupage bottle which I have done with glue gun. And I hope you can see this. Yeah. So this is one of the very favorite bottle of mine and this can be yours. So in this one I had actually given the textures with the glue gun and then I did my decoupage work and I added some shimmer paint on this. So in person this looks really 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 beautiful. Now for my next project. Oh this is one of the very recent one and I loved it. Although I got few dislikes on this video but I did not like it. 
Okay, so next one is uh, one of from my very recent videos and uh, from one of the very requested videos and that's uh, raisin and uh, yes, so this is the one. This is a raisin coaster. I did only one piece, so I'm going to give you this one raisin coaster. And this is one of the favorite color combinations that I have done, and the yellow gray combination. And I absolutely love the way my um, texture and my pop out work is there. So this is mosaic decoupage, not raisin. It is actually mosaic decoupage work. I'll keep this here. Next, next, next. One of my very, very, very favorite wall art and uh, welcome board actually. And this is the one. Welcome to my happy place. And I actually made this that I will use it in my uh, at my home. But uh, like I said, I really want to appreciate you all for always, always, always encouraging me. So I'm going to give this also for sure 200 percent. I'm sharing this with you all out there. One lucky person is going to get this too. Who will get what? That is something which I'm going to decide when I'm sending my projects to you all. So I can't commit right now that this one is something which I'm going to give it to you or that person. Now... One more, one more explosion box. Uh, it's tutorials also live on my channel. So, ta-da! This is the one and this is a really, really interesting one. So, this explosion box opens in a complete 12 by 12 sheet form. So, can you really see? This is actually like this. And in the center, it has a cute little niche where you can have a chocolate or some cute little goodies and this is actually a two uh, three layer explosion box with a centerpiece and when you once you open it it opens like this i love 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 this one and i'm sure i will hope you all will like these gifts too so this is actually diwali time in india diwali is a festival which we all celebrate and we share gifts so I just thought that I'll upload this video before Diwali so that after Diwali, once I'm back from my hometown, I can uh, start dispatching all these stuff to the selected people out there. Uh, so yes, you need to follow the instructions which I'm going to post at the end. Stay tuned. Yes, now one of again, one of my very, very, very recent project. I'm not sure if it's video is already live, but I want to show this to you. And this is one of the mobile hangers which I did after long time. So there was this trend in India that everyone was doing mobile hangers and that was really in trend around 2-3 years back. At that time I did uh, like so many videos on, uh, no not so many videos actually, I did so many projects on uh, mobile hangers. And after some long time I did this one and I did my decoupaging mixed media technique and I was really impressed by uh, Few of the ink pads, the Indian based ink pads, which I absolutely love using for my card making, and it actually worked really well for this one. So I'll just show you this one that this is how it looks. So I'm going to give this to also one of the lucky people, or maybe I'll share something else, but it's going to be dead. Oh, I just forgot to show you this stamp. This is also I have created with one of the price tags of my stuff. So if you are getting this tag you will know that how much shopping I do and what was the price of that. <laughs> now again this was also a mixed media project which I did and uh, oh, I have my husband, my children cut up balls so this I'm not going to give because this is something which I always carry with me. I really can't do without it you know with like all the celebrities this is something which I need to have and I before stepping off, out of my house I make sure that I have this in my bag. Okay, so yes, now this is the one. Uh, this is actually a hexagonal album which I did and I was really reluctant on doing it. I was not really sure if I can make this but when I did it, it turned out amazing. So you can just see all these flaps which is coming out. Video tutorials already like there on my channel, you can check. So in this one, you can have your pictures, you can do some journaling with the nice uh, glitter pens or the golden pens which are, which is there in the market and uh, 
this is how it is so this looks amazing 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 and if you just do it upside down you can actually also use it as a hanging like a photo hanging so it's up to you that how you want to use it as a hexagonal album or you want to do a hanging piece with all your pictures in these uh, flaps and they are going to look amazing amazing so definitely i'm sharing this one with one of you out there too okay and uh, last but not the least i love working with mdf for base i absolutely absolutely love these and this is one of the tags which i have created very recently very very recently i am not sure by the time you watch this video the tutorial is live or not but this is one of the decoupage and mixed media tags which i have done so here i have this beautiful decoupage paper napkin with some texture work on it and yes so this is also which i am going to share and i absolutely love this one this is something which you just give it to any of your close friends or family and they are going to love it and it also has a clip where you can add any of the sentiment or mini note or a, some small message here a personalized message so yes this is it so my bag is empty now so my video with what's in my bag is done and i hope you all enjoyed this tutorial um no this is not a tutorial i hope you enjoyed this video i'm so much used to say i hope you enjoyed this video tutorial no this is not a tutorial this was just a video on what's there in my bag i really wanted to share this with you all and yes i also wanted to tell you that what all stuff i really want to share with you all guys out there and i genuinely i from the bottom of my half my heart i really want to say thank you so much thank you so 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 much for always appreciating my work for uh, always encouraging me and uh, pouring in your suggestions every now and then and okay so with this my video on what's in my bag is done and i hope you all like seeing my project and thank you so much for always encouraging me and appreciating my work now yes the rules you need to share this video and few of my videos whichever uh, the product is there here i'm sharing all the links in the description box you have to share all those videos in the social media platforms like instagram pinterest and uh, your facebook your whatsapp wherever you can and uh, yes you need to tag us everywhere our facebook page link is there down below our youtube channel is there down below and yes you have to comment on all the products which is there their tutorials you have to leave some love and we will be selecting uh, the lucky winners very soon and i will be sharing the names very very soon so do participate and do get uh, this chance to win these uh, handmade goodies from me thank you so 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 much for watching take care bye bye